Hey, what's going on everyone? Moose here and today we have an unboxing going on. This is for the Feachi RS30 reflex sight. Um, transparently, they did send it to me. Uh, this is actually the second one that I've gotten uh, from them. I have one that came with the magnification combo, but they asked for an unboxing and I thought, you know what? It's a decent enough piece of kit. Let's just go ahead and take a look at what comes in the box. So when you open it up, you're going to get your user's manual, um, which, okay, it's, a, it's one of the good fold-outs. So uh, it talks about the specifications, the magnifications, the uh, aperture view, uh, blah, 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 all the batteries in the front, which does take a lot of batteries, which is good. Uh, it tells you how to install them. Uh, the different uh, types of reticles that you can set, windage elevation and uh, lens care and warranty uh, 12 months you can return to Feachi for repair or replacement it does not cover normal wear and tear so eh, I mean to be honest with you Feachi that's a little shoddy uh, because normal wear and tear uh, is normal right um, I would say it doesn't carry abuse maybe uh, but to be honest with you that kind of that kind of leaves it open to interpretation, which in my opinion, even though these aren't expensive, that's a really bad idea. You guys should really up your game and uh, offer a 12-month warranty for what it is and uh, give it to us uh, just like everybody else. So uh, you are going to get a lens cloth. You're going to get a little stack of batteries. You're going to get uh, two Allen keys. <clears throat> and then the um, device itself. Um, I know you shouldn't have to say this, but make sure you take good care of these. Uh, dogs will try to eat these, your kids, uh, stuff like that. Just make sure they get thrown away. Um, so let's see. Uh, all right, so it does come with two sets of batteries. One's already installed, uh, and then you get a backup set of batteries. Good job, good job. Maybe that makes up a little bit for the warranty. I'm just kidding, it does not. Um, but let's see here. So it does look like, um, all right. I'm just trying to see the inner workings in there. It does look like it's a spring system. So if you tighten this, it'll actually can't the, the, the unit itself. So it's not moving the, uh, radical, um, via the camera. Um, you know, it is what it is. Let's see if we can get that looking down there. Yeah, you guys can kind of see that. Kind of, sort of. It's kind of tough to see through the... Oh, there we go. There we go. So there's your... Uh, first... There's the first radical that you can get. The second radical. Third radical. And then your dot. Uh, there it is. The dot. So, overall, I mean, I had pretty good luck with the first one that I got from them. Um, I didn't have any real issues. Uh, it, you know, it, is it going to hold up to um, super abuse? No, uh, it, it, it's not waterproof at all. I mean, I could see the circuit board uh, right there on the bottom. So, you know, it's not going to do well outdoors. Um, you know, in the, in the weather, uh, without it, well, at least without coating that, um, I like to use, um, some lubricants on there that'll actually seal that. And it does make it a little bit better. Um, but you know, I mean, for what it is and the price that it's at, you know, is it, is it going to hold up? I don't know. Um, I, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to go ahead and throw one of these on to, um, you know, some of my different firearms that have, um, different, uh, recoils. Actually, maybe what we'll do is just throw this right onto one of the shotguns, uh, that we got from Black Aces Tactical. Uh, so that's probably what we'll do. We'll probably throw it on the lever gun and, uh, just, uh, take it out and blow through a bunch of rounds. See if it holds any kind of zero. Um, but overall, I mean, you know, good quality, 
Um, you know, I hadn't had any problems with the other one that I got. You know, is it an EOTech? No. Is it, you know, is it, a, is it a name point? No. Is it, you know, any of the big name brands? No, not at all. But, um, is it capable? Yes. Uh, is it going to be what I trust um, my life with? I don't know. Well, that'll be two to be determined. Uh, you know, one thing I can honestly say is that with any kind of optic like this that I would put onto a firearm that potentially might be a lifesaver for me, I'm also going to run back up iron sights. It's just good practice. It doesn't matter who you are, how long you've been shooting, anything like that. I don't care if you've got the best of the best of the best. Uh, batteries can die. Optics can fail. Things can get broke. Everybody has a backup set of iron sights. Um, so, you know, do I, do I think this is going to hold up? I don't know. Time's going to tell for sure. Um, but we'll throw this thing on this shotgun and, uh, we'll go from there. So as a matter of fact, I'll put a picture of it on the shotgun, uh, right here. Bow. All right, there you go. So that's what we're going to do with this. And, uh, we're going to enjoy it. Actually, I can't blow because I'm shooting this on my phone. Wait, maybe I can. No, I can't. Ah, either way, I'll drop a photo somewhere. Follow me on Instagram. I'll put a picture of it on Instagram uh, on the shotgun itself. So, all right, till next time, be good to each other. God bless. We'll talk to you guys all soon. See you.